So let us discuss pairs that you should trade in the month of the November. I have quite a few. So each and every lesson I'll be covering what you should trade and then I'll do a series where you what you should not trade. So this lesson 61, let's focus on GBPUSD. For me, I believe GBPUSD has a good opportunity for us to focus on it. Um, and I'll tell you my theory, but they have a very crazy theory on GBPUSD and pay attention. It might, uh, they might take my theory, the market might miss my theory, but at the end of the day, for me, it's to um, it's to um, predict what the market will do. Then once it does what I have said, I react to the market. Okay, guys. So uh, we are doing GBPUSD analysis, and because we want to, uh, we had done the monthly. You remember, guys, telling you about the monthly analysis on the other video. I told you we have how many patterns. Let me show you. I gave you there were three patterns, guys. Uh, the reason why I didn't want to be in details because we were not discussing GBPUSD. So here is my theory. Pattern one, double bottom on 1985. So this is the first double bottom. So we have this double bottom that has never hit half. So this is our P1. Guys, I want to show you my theory and I know they can use it. So pattern one is that. Then we come to pattern two. I believe the reason why they used pattern two, even the neck, the, the neckline was broken, is because pattern two it is taken very seriously. So for me, I believe from all that, from the neckline, we didn't have any any other pattern. Can you see? From the neckline here, there was no pattern because this was not like a double top. The market went broke. And then we got now this is pattern two. So we have our pattern two here. And pattern two broke neckline. So follow closely to this theory. So we have pattern two breaking um, the neckline. You can see pattern two has broke the neckline. Now, once we have pattern two, uh, we believe that this market should sell down because pattern two mostly, at least it goes to half. But they don't want to sell it because it will be an obvious trade. If they do this, it will be an obvious trade. So what they did, they look, they they activated pattern three. So pattern three, guys, is what I was telling you. Now you're not finding it on the monthly. Why? Because what they did on the, the on this retracement, you see this retracement. Once the oh, once the neckline was broken here, the market started to retrace, and even they showed you that uh, it has broken a resistance. So majority people dropped the idea of the double top. So they, they thought there's no way this can be a retracement and it has started to make new highs. So the market started to make a new high and a high low, a new high and a high low, a high high and a high low. But there is a, something that has happened. Uh, the market, instead of making a high low, it has made a lower low. Can you see guys? So this is something that we need to, to understand. But before it made a high, a lower low, when this market broke this resistance and made this high, you can see this high, what happened in the weekly time frame? they activated pattern three. So pattern three was activated and this is our pattern three guys. The question is what if pattern three is what they will use for to, for, to take this market down? So they activated pattern three. So as we stand, pattern three is like that. This is our pattern three. P3 and all of the way we know pattern three always goes uh complete. Pattern three is the most uh, accurate pattern, pattern three, pattern four. So they, they give us pattern three. So we need to check where is the half of pattern three? Where is the half of pattern three? Where is the half of pattern three? Let's see. Where is the half? Where do you think the half is? So <clears throat> this market might sell back to 1.177. Can you see where, where the half is? This is the original half of that top, double top of pattern three on the weekly. So what they did on the weekly, they, they have a, a double top. And this double top, the reason why it is very strong, it is not on the monthly. I think I have said this several times. So I'm building my theory and I want to know where are we standing? So we have this double top 
And this double top from where the market is, from where the market is, the market can drop 417 pips. It is an easy trade you can sell. But this is where the catch is. They already know <clears throat> that majority have already seen this double top and majority have buy position, sell position. So my theory is not to sell now because selling now, if you don't have a big account, you'll be stopped out. So this is monthly. That double top is not on the monthly. So we can't, we have, this market has to go down. But the question is, when? When will the market go down? When will this market come here? That is the question. You know, there's um there's a way you can know the market what will do. You can know everything. But the biggest question you have to ask yourself always is when. The when is the most important. Why? Because when if you don't have your when, when is it doing it? When? When? Yes, it will sell, but at what time? Will it sell tomorrow? Will it sell next week? Will it take a month before it sells? So the idea of the banks, they already know, majority have spotted the double top pattern three. So what they have done, what they have done, they continued with the pattern. You can see from the pattern three, you don't have another pattern. So they go to the daily and activate a new pattern. Activate a new pattern. So on the daily, we have a double bottom that's only on the daily. We have a double bottom that is only on the daily, very clear double bottom that is only on the daily. So if we measure half, higher chances, 95%, the market first it will buy to stop out everyone who has sell position. That is my theory, by the way. For me, what I believe is that this double top being pattern four, majority are not considering it. In fact, because it has really um, ranged for a very long time, majority are not considering this double bottom, which is our pattern for. From where the market is, from where the market is, this is the, this is like it's 400 pips. You can imagine 400 pips, the market is going to 400 pips. And now from 400 pips, the banks can activate their sell limit so that they can now sell back and earn even more. You see now the distance from the half to it's worth it, it's worth the risk. So pattern four and you see they already know they already know that this pattern form it is a two-two way it can give you a cup and handle let me tell you the trick here this can give you an inverted cup and handle or it can give you a complete double bottom so they have left you to choose so the banks already they know what they'll do according to the choices you will choose so if majority chooses sell they will buy. If majority chooses buy, they will sell. So that cap and handle, inverted cap and handle, uh, as we are waiting for the market, let me change the color. As we are waiting for the market to come half, eventually the market can even continue to go down if they take this pattern, cap and handle. So for me, I believe my theory is pointing out the market will buy fast because there is no much there won't be much benefit for them to sell immediately because majority are selling. So they will give retail trader opportunity to make money. So we have this pattern five, which is a ranging channel. Can you see guys, this is our pattern five. They can still use it, P5. So P5 already we know a ranging channel, the market either goes on the upper side or the market goes where on the lower side. So you see the decision they are trying to leave you is for you to make a decision. Guys, do not, do not attempt. Do not attempt to make a decision. They are waiting for that decision. Just hold on. Just, just watch, watch it, watch it play. So if this channel is broken, that's where the market is going. So if the market even goes the half of the distance, can you see? Half of the distance, can you see what will be happening? The market has a chance either to activate this double top so that you can have a, a, part, a, a pattern to trade or they can activate this double top or they can activate this double top. They have so many chances. 
So let me tell you guys, don't think of selling if your market is not on this safe zone. This is our safe zone, one, two, three. So if we, wa if we want to check if they are on the weekly, these safe zones, are they on the weekly? How safe are they? Because if they are on the weekly, they are not safe. So for those who are trying to sell, hey, have patience, don't sell now. Just watch, this is this is free movie. Watch the movie and for it. So you can see, so the, the farthest, the farthest is still on the weekly. So the first, the farthest being on the weekly, if the market continue buying, 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 and go to the weekly, let's see if that uh, it is on the monthly. It is not. So for me, I don't know why. I have, my theory is the market might buy fast. Might buy fast. That's my theory. The market might buy fast. So what we don't want to do we don't want to get involved inside here. Let's just wait. Let's just wait. The market can also break out with a red candle. Be careful so that you don't get a fake breakout. They might break there and and uh, autom and at the next minute they are buying. So they might break here because they know everyone will will be selling. So once they break this zone, they can still buy. So we have to be very careful on, on what the market makers are trying to pull us to do. So they can break there and still, uh, the markets can still buy. So my theory, and this is my theory guys, GPUSD, we have to wait for it. It's like a movie. You see how you wait? You see how the movie starts? You don't know the, you don't know the bad character. Someone is killed or someone is some something is stolen or something happens, and all of us we are in darkness, we don't know. But there's the way the movie unfolds, and you can know whoever did the action. So at this point, everyone is in darkness. So can we wait on GBPSD? Or what do you think? Guys, comment down below. Do you think GBPSD will buy fast or it will sell fast? What do you think? Because the market is on a sale, but what do you think they'll do? So for me, I'm just I will just be checking every day. Like I'm not in a rush because if I can sell on this area, if I can get my sell opportunities around this area, this will be a very, very good, good opportunity, guys. It will be a fantastic opportunity if I, we get ourselves around this area. But selling here, it is, I, I can't, I can't. It's better, it's better I miss that opportunity. So we are being saved almost 400 pips. 400 pips, let me tell you. If you sell now and you're taking 400 pips, chances are you have blown your account or you're in a massive negative or you're stopped out. So that's my theory, guys. So I'll be patient. I will come back. Now I won't talk of GBPUSD again unless it does exactly what I say. I have said, for me, I'm seeing it coming back, hitting our half and either activating these three zones. And if they break like this, it might be even a fake breakout. The market can break and still move up. They can break that area and still, the market can still move up and move, 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 still come to this area. So we have to be patient. And when you hear me now discussing GPUSD, you know there's an opportunity. Right now it's a theory and all the best on the theory. I don't know what, are you trading GPUSD? Are you in a position, have you traded? Have you opened a position for me? I'm still waiting for the right opportunity. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. I hope it has been helpful. In the next lesson, we will discuss our theory in another pair. Thank you so much. Love you. Bye-bye.